Hi guys, so I was going to try a quick, easy sewing project. I'm going to make a bucket hat. And I'll give you a link to this pattern. It's a free pattern. So thank you to Orange Betty for sharing that on Pinterest. It's really nice of you to share a free pattern. Um, I'm going to get three pieces. Very easy. And there's three pieces for the interfacing. But I just used I just need to face the back of the fabric. So that's going to be the outside and that's going to be the inside. So it's going to be kind of reversible, kind of Alice in Wonderland. So I've cut all my pieces out. Now I tried using a fat quarter, which I would not recommend. You need a bigger stretch really um, because I've had to cut the brim piece in four rather than two so I'm going to have added a little bit of seam allowance so I'm going to stitch all those together um, and I also made a boo boo with the crown pieces I was trying to save time and I cut it I folded it and cut it so now I've got a piece that is upside down so don't do that <laughs> but there you go it's my first one and it's Alice in Wonderland so you know upside down doesn't really matter does it well we'll see so that's all that ready so basically you sew all the outside pieces together sew all the inside pieces together sew the two together fold it inside out and then do some st stitches around the edge and the brim to make sort of ridges sort of oh I don't know what I'm sorry um yeah so let's go cracking so I have my lining all sewn together and I did the top stitching around the top on the lining and I don't really like the look of it so I didn't do it on my outer piece really tricky to sort of sew around these curves. So now we're going to go ahead and sew these two together, right sides together, leave a little gap, turn it out and then do our circles around the brim. <laughs> shape I think I'm probably gonna wash it and reshape it but I don't need to get rid of these threads <laughs> yeah it's cute 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 <laughs> it's really stiff because of that interfacing yeah oh, that'd be nice in the sun and I'm definitely gonna make some more of these probably want to make one uh, with some of the uh, more gothic material that I've got, you know, to match everything else. <laughs> um, 
yeah so i hope you enjoyed that i didn't film a lot of it um so it'd be a quick little video uh but yeah uh go along to the uh link below to get the pattern uh, it's really easy to follow the only difficult part really is sewing round and you know all the different shapes that circle is very tricky so I have caught it in a few places but I don't mind I think it looks great very cute so uh, I have to go because my battery's flashing so thank you for watching and I'll see you again soon bye